Hey guys, this is Markbook Pro here with a quick mountain lion tip for you guys. Um, one of my biggest complaints about OS X Lion, and one of the reasons I never adopted it, was the fact that they omitted save as from the workflow. Uh, duplicate to me just, it, it seems like it's extra work. I mean, it is extra work because you have to duplicate your file and then save it. Whereas save as, you basically do that all in, all in one click, right? Um, well, in Mountain Lion, they actually brought back save as, even though it's a little bit hidden. We go up under the file menu, and we notice duplicate is still there, which now has a keyboard shortcut of shift command s, which is nice because in Lion it didn't have a keyboard uh, command at all. Um, and now what we can do is actually hold down option on our, on our keyboard and it will turn that duplicate into save as. So right now I'm holding down option, I let go again, it turns back into duplicate, hold down option, save as, so on and so forth. Now those who used Macs for a long time will remember, back in Snow Leopard and every OS prior to that, shift command s was save as. Well now on Mountain Lion, since it, they graciously gave save as back to us, it's now option shift command s. So I like the fact that they gave us back save as, but I want more. I want save as to be there permanently, and I want duplicate to be the one that shows up when I hold down option. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, what we want to do to make that happen is go into system preferences. And we're going to go into keyboard. And if it opens up to this screen by default, just go ahead and click on keyboard shortcuts here at the top because we want to see this. Now on this left sidebar here, let's click the very last option, which is keyboard shortcuts, or application shortcuts rather. Now we want this setting to be universal across our entire system, right? So let's select all applications just to make sure we make a, an all applications one. We want to add one, so let's hit the plus sign. Now as you see here, enter the exact name of the menu command you want to add. So what we need to have, uh, what we need to put in here is exactly how save as appears under the file menu when we bring it up. And that is like this, save as dot dot dot. All right, so let's go back to our keyboard shortcut uh, preference pane here. So let's type in save as, capital S and capital A, dot dot dot, right? Save as dot dot dot. The keyboard shortcut we want is Shift Command S, because that's what we're used to and all that we uh, all know and love from Snow Leopard. And let's make sure we're on all applications again. Hit the plus sign again. Let's make one for duplicate. Duplicate, no dot 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 this time, just one word. And let's do Option Shift Command S. All right, and we'll add that. Now we can close out of here. Now let's pull down the file menu. And look at that. Save as is now the default option under file. And we hold down the option key and now it will turn into duplicate. So I hope that this um, helped you guys out. A lot of you I'm sure have been wanting save as back as opposed to duplicate. Um, so this is pretty much um, you know exactly the way we're used to it from Snow Leopard. And I can hit shift command s and now save as will um, come up as opposed to duplicate which is really nice and I can save this where I want to and there's my document on my desktop even though you can't see it because I'm only recording a portion of my screen but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, you know please let me know what you think in the comments at least we have our save as back as a default option so um, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video